Hello everybody and welcome back to Red Dead 2. So, uh, made it to this town yesterday, Strawberry, I think that's what it's called. And now we gotta get Micah out of jail. As you can tell, this is jail. I imagine there can be a couple ways to do this. Yep. You can pay, Hello, sir. I've, you can uh, I've break him out, water. you can probably I'm sneak him out. Of a dangerous gang, Tom O'Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mix, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. I mean, would I care if he got hung? All right, well, I tried. Mika? Mika? Hey, pal. Arthur! Arthur! Hi. Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you gonna get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Do I? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people. Should have brought backup. You swing. You got to do something, Arthur. <sighs> Maybe that's Why do I have both really guns on my back? Works. This thing? Oh, time for an old-fashioned breakout. Yes. Hook that over the bars. See if you can pull them off. All right. What a modern disaster this is going to be. Just pull that lever. How secure? Come on. You know, just in case. I'm gonna put this on my face. That rhymes. How do you start this thing? Eh. Go steal donkey. And there we go. Alright, Micah. Get ready to run. Let's get out of here. Come on. Who's that? Who's that? Oh, okay. No, I have the mask on, you can't tell. We don't have to do this, boys. Be all peaceful here. Alright, where's my horse? Oh, why is he going that way? I really don't want to be killing all these people. I just came into this town. Not saying good example here. Oh, who the? Where'd you come from? Does it matter? I guess you can get it yourself. Oh, you lucky bastard. God damn. Get him in the chest. What fuck you call me? Call me a woman? I think I got the door. Skinny Pete? That guy sounds like Dutch. Serious? That is a sturdy door. 
Maybe I should have let him die. Or rot. Headshot with a shotgun. That one's gotta hurt. So you're gonna wipe out an entire town? My god, man. Okay, that was a weird slow motion. Oh! Hang on. Ugh. Well, I'm, I bet Dutch is going to be happy to hear. I let you out and we just slaughtered an entire town. I swear to God, if my bounty is like $500, though, I'm going to smack you. I guess you ain't anymore. Didn't end well. I saw how goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely, I promise. Yeah, storm's yeah, coming. Well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. For some unknown reason. I think we finally lost him. I, hope I think so. we killed them all. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. <clears throat> why you act all sour all yeah, the time. Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court chest? Right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you... And me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. He's our papa. Sometimes, brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back a strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. So you ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <laughs> Bye now. What was that? Okay. Is your peace offering going to be Calm O'Driscoll? Offhand holster. What do I have two now? Ooh la la. I got one on my dick, one on my side. Alright. So I can now carry two sidearms at once and dual wield? Awesome. So. Yep. Yeah, that town's in lockdown. Obviously. Don't think I should go back there anytime soon. Nope, that's black water. That's strawberry. Sixty or eighty-five dollars? God damn, Mika. Micah, I'm gonna punch you in the face next time I see ya. Okay, well now we got two missions. We can either talk to Hosea, who has like another business proposition. Or we could talk to this woman who I got a letter from. What's her name? Mary? She requests my help. Sure, let's go talk to her. So what are my sawed off shotgun and my revolver? Okay. Yeah. Really you should try and buy new guns. I got money. I stop in Valentine, maybe I'll stop at a gunsmith. Sound like someone's in trouble. Arthur Morgan to the rescue. What? Oh, shit. I didn't realize she's on him. Ooh, better idea. 
Come here, you. All right. Come on, lasso. Go. All right. You stay right there. Where'd that lady go? She's still on the horse, isn't she? Hello. Oh, uh, whoops. Oh, horse, come back. I got you. Like, I just dropped her on the ground. Okay. You're welcome. Oh, oh, thank the Lord you showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. It's all right, ma'am. It's over now. Thank you. Again. Oh, uh, you getting dirty, John? Where's your brush hat? There you go. Have a good one. Thanks for not giving me anything. Poor woman. Idiot. All right, this guy's still on the ground. I've unlocked skid turns. Hold RB and A when moving to perform these. Okay. Quick things first. All right, we can go now. So RB and A. So it's like a stop. Can you like turn left or right? Oh yep. Yeah. Okay. Also, there's a bear. Easy. Should I go for it? I mean, the bow would be the best bet. You studied. Yields a claw, fat, and big game meat. Used in crafting and cooking and can be sold. Used with a, use a bow with improvised arrows or a long scope rifle for a clean kill. Okay. That's all the info. You know what? Let's save it. And then I'll go for it. Okay. Suck it, bear. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. Oh shit, we got it. I thought it'd be like 20 arrows. Alright. Sean, do you think you can carry this? Alright, how do you skin a bear? This is gonna be graphic. Those frames. Hold on there, boy. <laughs> Let me get you get down. Ugh. Sorry if you're a guy. Man, that takes a long time for you to cut through it. Ugh, that's a big pelt. Oh my god. I am so sorry. Alright. Here are some bear pelt. Whoop. It's like bigger than half the carcasses I put on this thing. Can I do anything with you? I don't think so. Alright, John. It was a good fight. We did good. That's me. Look what I got on my back. It's a big bear skin. Pelt. I take the, is it a skin or pelt? It's the same thing, right? Because all that was left of that bear was muscle. Oh, uh, Pearson. I think you'll be very pleased to see what I have. It's bear blood, though. It's alright. And it might be like half the town of Strawberry's blood, but that's fine. Why is it poor? Is it because I used multiple arrows and only one would have done good? Alright, well, here you go. Could bear pelt have been used for anything? I should really make a workbench. How much did that cost? I think I would have enough, but it'd be like most of my money. 225. Alright. All 
And how much are the satchels gonna cost? Probably a fuck ton, right? Now, is that all my money gone or the camp money? Ooh, that was all the camp. Okay. Uh, let me donate some into there then. Here you go. A hundred. That should be alright. Still got more than you guys. Oh, is that an achievement? Give to the poor. You've donated $250. I guess I have. Alright. So now what requires me to make these satchels? Now I have to upgrade shit too? Alright. Perfect deer, perfect elk, perfect panther. God damn. Perfect deer, perfect beaver, perfect rabbit. How do I get perfects? Hey Lenny. Five finger fillet? Ooh. I think I know what that is. Lenny? Hey, Arthur. That knife's sharp enough, ain't it? Depends. Why? You feel lucky? Do you? Oh, before me? At least six generations were born in chains. And for the last three years, I've been running from every lawman and bounty hunter west of the Lanahassee River. So yeah, I feel lucky. I'm the living embodiment of luck. That is one way of seeing things. But I'm also skilled. And in this game, you got to have luck and skill. I think it's just all skill. Stupidity. The Outlaw's Trinity. Luck, skill, and just a dose of stupidity. Come on. You ain't too old and too slow just yet. After you. As you wish. Yeah, it'd be a shame if you, you can know, actually cut your fingers off. head back up that mountain sometime and make Jenny a proper grave. Some nice. You liked her, didn't you, kid? All right, I got no idea how to play this. I already sent a wire to the doctor for you. Ooh. So it's just A and X? Four twenty four two two one. All right. Oh, that's not fair. I got more attempts. All right, pot's twenty cents. Is it best two out of three? Oh, that should add towards your time. Ooh, last one. Alright. That was faster. Means I gotta be faster. Oh, shit. What is it now? B? Boom. Alright, I think if I zoom in, it tells me what the buttons are. Alright, now it's why. Oh, we gotta go twice? Alright. I've got this. I think. Boom. Almost a full second before you. 20 cents? That's fucking nothing. Uh, no. I'm good. Cut my finger once, you cut yours like ten times. So, I think we all know who won. Okay, off to Valentine. Like I said in the first place. Oh, god damn it. The home robbery. I said I wanted to do it. It might only be during nighttime that I get pops up in the camp. Uh, it'll be fun. I could do her mission in the next part. Hello, Javier. You ready to pull off a heist? Or like a homestead Javier. robbery? Where did that guy come from? about a house? Could be interesting. This is it the house I told you about? No. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. I think this is a different one than the one I was talking course, about. Uh, yeah, it's dubious, but... There ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. Yeah. So I don't know how to find 
That house the guy told me about. Uh, I don't. I guess you just gotta find it on your own. Oh, thank god it's gonna skip it for us. Oh, thank you, game. I love looking at the scenery, but goddamn, horses are a lot slower than cars. Alright, are we here yet? Okay, we're pretty close now. Let's stop and go on foot from here. Alright, well, let me just up the hill get my bow. Way. I'll switch out the shotgun since I've now got sawed off. Oh, I'm getting cold. Hold on, my winter clothes. Oh, yes. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like Are they Star Wars fans? Especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? I'm guessing that's them over there. <sighs> Big place, right? They got werewolves. Nope, not a full moon. Never mind. You got your binoculars. Yep. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. I'd guess around three. In any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Boy. I think we need to draw them out somehow. And I got an idea. Follow me. I'm guessing we don't want to go slicey slicey up in there. All these trees. I can't get a proper look at the place. Well, Let's just walk past them then. Harder for them to spot us too. The coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. Hey, keep it down. I hear voices. You're the one talking. Come on. Let's hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Maybe you hunt a pig this time. Just stay quiet. We can easily take these guys out. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be poor. No, they got guns. Never mind. But to leave. But ten minutes I was. My head is not hidden at all. Cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie, get all the jam. You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt. I will. I can tell what you mean by their own dialect. Up. Go guard the shed. Go. You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. I thought this was the shed. What are we doing out of here? Okay. Take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see. And do you want me to throw a knife? Stealth or all out? Be quiet. Sorry. This guy's coming right towards me. Oh, never mind. He's in the house. Alright, just in case, let me take these up. Oh, I see what you did. That's a good distraction. What the hickory happened here? These guys have the weirdest dialect. Alright, should we take them out? We got to put this out, don't you? Okay. Let's take them out quick. The rest of you are like Oh shit, how many of them are there? Are these guys Canadian? I'm going in. Here's a bow. So, oh, 
<laughs> right in the head. Oh. oh, come on out of there. Why don't you? Ooh, sorry, lady. At least I made it quick for you. I think we got them. Damn, that was a good shot. I think I found the stash. Has to be under here. Or it could be up here. Hey Arthur. Give me a hand here. On A. That's fifty. Jewelry bag. Fifty. Alright, what you got down here? Ooh. You want the money or not? <coughs> Push. Push. Ah, that looks more like a treasure chest. Well, look what we have here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah. You take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. How much that is that? good. <coughs> You're gonna say how much it was? 175, alright. Man, those horses are going crazy. How do I make you flee? I'm gonna calm you down first. No, I should study you. I don't know what you are. Tennessee Walker. How do I free you from this? Do I try and get on you? Oh wait, I can search your saddlebag? Yeah. Thanks for the brandy. And the crackers. All right, get. Go on now. Get, girl. Slap her on the ass. Come on, get. Oh fuck! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, there's no one coming back for these guys, so I might as well free them. You look like you're calm. Okay. I didn't even hit you. I was searching the saddlebag. God damn it. Alright. I think we're good. Those horses can go fuck themselves. Okay, well. Cucumber land. Nope, Cumberland. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this part here. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for the next part where we'll finally continue on with an actual mission. So, thank you all for watching. Be sure to do it down below. Leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you on the next part. Goodbye.